Getting a dog is a long-term expense, but the initial investment matters too, which begs the question, how much do wiener dogs cost in pet stores and breeders? We know that this is one of the most popular dog breeds out there. Dachshunds also have one of the longest lifespans and are generally a fantastic family pet. Does this mean that they are overly expensive? Also, does it matter where you get your doxy from? We'll cover all that below. How much do wiener dogs cost on average? It's impossible to point to a single number here as dachshunds can cost as little as $200 or as much as $3,500. You can even find free abandoned doxies in many shelters and rescues, while some rare pups can cost north of $5,000. So, we could calculate an average price of $1,850 if we wanted to but that doesn't mean anything. The fact of the matter is that how much your future docs is going to cost will depend on a myriad of factors we'll explore next. Why does the dachshund price fluctuate that much? The calculation behind a doxy's price is quite complicated. It includes factors such as 1, whether the dog is purebred or not, 2, whether there is a certain rare coat or genetic variation, and three, where you're buying the dog from. And it's that last point that's the most crucial one. How much do dachshunds cost at pet stores and puppy mills? Even when talking about just pet stores and puppy mills, it's difficult to cite a concrete price. Most of the time, doxies in pet stores will cost between $500 and $2,000, but there are exceptions. This too is a significant diapason, and it depends on how purebred the puppy is and how prestigious the brand of the store is. However, even expensive and supposedly purebred doxy puppies at pet stores will still usually come from puppy mills. This is crucial to note because dogs aren't bred adequately at most puppy mills. These places are notorious for their low breeding standards for not paying attention to genetic diversity. Letting dogs pass on their negative genetic predispositions is commonplace at most puppy mills, and that means a lot of potentially sick doxies sold at pet stores. Additionally, both puppy mills and pet stores are often under fire for their horrible living conditions. This is by design too, seeing a small pup in a tiny cage is heartbreaking and nudges the client to make the purchase. However, it's also straight up torture for the pup itself. How much are wiener dogs at shelters and rescues? Doxies are unfortunately common in shelters and rescues as are many other breeds. A lot of them are both healthy and purebred too, they are just unlucky with having been bought by crappy people. Price-wise, a dachshund from a shelter can cost as little as $100 to $200 or it can even be free. This will depend both on the condition of the dog and the condition of the shelter. If you want to adopt, it's important to remember to ask for a health certificate or a detailed vet checkup and report. There's nothing wrong with getting a dog that's not in perfect health, but it's important to know what you're getting into. What's the purebred dachshund price at reputable breeders? Professional and reputable breeders are the best place to visit if you want a healthy, well-adjusted, and purebred puppy. Their prices can be higher than those of pet stores, however, and that's due to all the care and effort that are put into breeding the best possible pups. A reputable breeder doesn't allow inbreeding and makes sure that all negative genetic predispositions are bred out of their pups. Such a breeder will always offer you a health certificate for their pups as well as certificates for the pup's parents. You should also ask to see your chosen pup's parents and litter personally. How much do wiener dogs cost compared to mini wieners? When talking about price fluctuation due to some variations in the breed, mini dachshunds are a prime example. Despite being much smaller, these tiny dogs often cost more than standard dachshunds. The only real difference between the two is the size, both variants look the same otherwise and have comparable health potential. But people do like their tiny doxies, so mini dachshunds cost closer to the upper limit of $3,500 or even more. Is the dachshund price an indicator of its health? One of the main things to remember when choosing a dachshund is that its price is closely linked to its health. The price alone is no health guarantee of course, you should always ask for a health certificate. However, properly bred and healthy dachshunds will almost always cost more than those from puppy mills.
buying a low-cost doxy isn't a guarantee for health issues either, of course. You can easily get a stray doxy from the street and have it live up to 20 years with no health risks. However, health is all about risk management and pricier dogs are always healthier on average. This means having a much better chance of avoiding any of the following possible health problems. Eye cataracts, diabetes, cancer, Cushing's disease, heart disease, intervertebral disc disease, acanthosis nigricans, obesity, Lafora disease, patellar luxation, progressive retinal atrophy, glaucoma, keratoconjunctivitis sicca, gastric torsion, seizures. So, how much do wiener dogs cost, and is the price worth it? Is a price of $3,500 worth it for a doxy compared to adopting another doxy from the pound? That depends on too many factors, a lot of which are unquantifiable. Speaking from a strictly monetary and statistical point of view, it's usually worth it. The main cost of looking after a dog comes with the veterinary costs later on in the dog's life. So if paying a bit extra up front can save you thousands and even tens of thousands of dollars down the line, that's a good investment. On the other hand, with the right care, almost any dog can have a long and happy life. If you liked this video don't forget to like and subscribe.